Thanks for joining us for another video today guys. We're going to be looking at Tom on-site climbing and if anybody doesn't know what an on-site is because it's their first time to a climbing channel, welcome. But also an on-site is where you step up to a route, you have no knowledge of that route or the existing beta and how to get up the route. You don't know where the holds are, you don't know where the feet are and you climb it clean to the top. I think there's only two different types of on-site climbing, draws in and draws out. Uh, this is a draws out, so he has to put the quick draws in all the way up, which I think is the most ethical way to on-site climb. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. If it's your first time here, hit that like button, go down and subscribe if you wanna stay tuned for more climbing videos, because there'll be plenty more coming up. So let's get into it and watch Tom climbing the Whiskey Delta Trilogy. So as he steps up to this first little section, you can see he's got this little boulder problem to deal with. Now he goes right hand up and shimmies up a few different handholds as he gets an undercling on the left hand side. Now when he does get his right hand up onto the uh, kind of slopey edge as he starts to stand up, he could just put his hand up one more and find a jug, but as he's on site and he can't see that, goes left hand up, which makes the foot pop because he's a little bit off balance. Manages to hold it together really well. One of the things I love about watching Tom climb is his footwork is really good. His body position is normally really good and he's really strong on his feet and composed at all times. As he finds the jug, now he just rocks over, mantles over the top of this final little boulder and then he's got some jugs to just go up to that second bolt, put his quick drawer in and uh, have a little rest, which is one of the really good ways to improve your on-site climbing is to learn when to rest, how to read the route properly and take as much rest as you can before you go into the next section. So he goes up, puts his third quick draw in and starts looking around for holds. As you can tell now, the holds have kind of run out. He's got to find the right ones before he steps off of this ledge because he's only got one shot at this climb. This is the start of the uh, main crux of the climb where the holds get a little bit thinner and he's got to look around the arete and he'll find himself like a little slopey crimp uses some pretty bad feet to stand up on but one thing that makes uh, Tom a really good on-site climber I think is his footwork and his stability so if you can really climb on your legs and on your feet you're not gonna get pumped out as much and it's gonna allow you more time to think and to find them next handholds as he balances his way up this next little section you see some holds out to the left where he's got to really stand up get away from them bent legs and then do a nice lock off to his next holds. Once he's got them, he has a bit of a crux clip coming up as well. So he's got to put the quick draw in and then clip the quick draw. Now what he does do is he puts the quick draw in kind of the wrong way around to how he wants to clip, which becomes a little bit of an issue for him. But he gets through it, he keeps his composure because he's only a couple of moves away from sending the climb. This is definitely the harder way to on-site climb, is to put the draws in as you are climbing. Uh, if you have the draws in already, uh, normally I call that a flash because you've got some form of beta on the route. Uh, but if you don't have any beta of how to climb it, some people will call that an on-site as well. Uh, so you can have a draws in, draws out. I think when you have the quick draws in, it always makes the climb that little bit easier because you don't have to worry about putting the quick draw in and then clipping it. Then he wraps up the climb with a nice little mantle onto the final ledge and that's him home free. Now I hope you enjoyed the video guys and I hope you found it useful. Uh, that was Tom on site in the Whiskey Delta Trilogy and he did it in style. Stylish pants anyway. If you enjoyed the video, I will see you in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.